Good weekend, everyone. Yeah, decent. Yeah, West West Ham oh, win and uh, our Sunday had... league team win as well. Not oh, bad. Nice. That's yeah, all right. right. No, you didn't win. Oh shit, we didn't win, did we? <laughs> oh, your fuck head. me! <laughs> I'm only think. I told you that. Like, I've given up on West Ham now. I only support Sporting Club to Mundial. Did we you, can do that again. Did you see your Lego forgot. score? And then you're like, oh, we won that. Shit, yeah, we won that. Yeah, just stop watching. Okay. Hello everyone, Timsy here and welcome back for the second episode of the group chat. This is our show where we take a look back at the Premier League and we also dive into our group chat to get your reactions to the games and I'm gladly joined by my good friend Sam Dis. Again, Sam, how are you doing? Yeah, good thanks mate. I'm glad that I've uh, graduated up to good friends. Yeah, so I put that in purpose. I can see what it is next week. You're welcome. Uh, and fellow Guna, my other good friend, hey. Pippa Monique. How are you doing, Pippa? I'm alright, you know. Yeah? Nervous for... Yeah, game, yeah we'll, we'll, we'll get on to that, <laughs> don't worry. Um, good weekend, everyone. Yeah, Sunday league team, first game of the season, 3-0. Which I is, did uh, actually. Yeah, all you need, didn't it? Oh, nice. Did you score? No. I nearly uh, give away a goal. I'm a centre half. So okay. I nearly, oh, nearly ruined it, okay, but yeah. I didn't quite. So I, I, that's, that's as good as a goal. My Saturday league team, we lost 8-3. That's, that's bad, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, really bad. I don't know. I know but I scored, though. Oh, my oh that's the main thing then. Mm. My son's Sunday League team won 4 2. Seems to be oh, nice. Sunday okay, League. So, we've got a nice so we both did <laughs> right, you did quite badly. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good. So, hopefully, Arsenal will redeem it tonight. I don't know. We'll see. Um, anyway, right. So, we'll move on to the Premier League this weekend. Mm. Quite a lot of goals. I quite enjoyed it. Yeah. It was fun. Yeah. Um, I liked football. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 football's they great. They should do it every week, I reckon. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> they should have some sort of league that we mm. can all follow. Um, so the first one, we'll just dive straight into it, is Ben Humphrey, Sheffield United fan, reacting to Sheffield nil, Liverpool 1. It was a fantastic performance by United, a heartbreaking way to lose it. A uh, mistake by Dean Henderson. He made up for it, though, with a brilliant save later uh, when Salah ran through. Fantastic performance by United. We held our own against Liverpool. We really should have held out for a nil-nil draw, but it's nice to see that we can go toe-to-toe with the best in the league and hold our own, like I said, use this performance positively going forward, uh, you know, to give us a bit of belief and self-confidence that we can compete with anyone in this league. I don't know, I like that he's looking at the positives. I think, you know what, I think I think that they're good. I think they've got a good manager and I think that Henderson was like unlucky in it. But like Their manager like, is hilarious. Chris Wilder's say. great. I'm a big I'm a big fan. When he was saying oh, I'm not gonna put an arm around Henderson and like pat his head or whatever, and he was like, Oh, he's a professional. Yeah, but equally th- he also said this guy he wants to go to Man United, you know, he wants to go be He can't yeah. he can't be making mistakes like that. Well, it's fair enough, isn't it? He's just but the power on that shot though, at least he got a touch on it. I know it's a bit of a sloppy mistake with that goal going know, in, but, but nah, he, not, also, he not also made a couple of big saves like yeah. as well. Do you know what yeah. I mean? He, he evens itself out. But exactly. So why would you then out your goalkeeper like that? He's not out him. He's, no, he's, it's, it's impossible to, to be more outed than like letting in a goal like that. But I feel like yeah. he's, he's how he comes back from it. I feel like he's got a, he's no, got a little bit of stick after it while there is. Being a bit harsh. And he's he's just but he's just a bit like, well, if he wants to be a Professional goalkeeper who wants to play at the highest level, then he's gonna mm. have to. Do yeah, it is true. But it's still just as or at least bounce back from that. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Everyone does it. Best goalkeepers yeah. in the world. Liverpool, oh, it's, they're, they're just they're good at winning. In yeah, it, I, know, I expected more from them though. So Sheffield did put out because they did have it. Sheffield did have chances. Yeah, yeah. for sure. But that's like that's how you win the league, isn't it? Or that's how you get towards winning the league. Just yeah. grinding them out against teams you just don't want you to win. Mm. And that Sheffield United team, they didn't like defend. They weren't just like fuck it, we're not going to leave our box, which yeah, some yeah. teams do. Yeah. But they were just like, well, we're going to give you a bit, we're going to give you a bit of a go. go. And I don't think that Liverpool were expecting that. And uh, there were a few times when they broke forward, yeah. where they did catch Liverpool, and it was, you know, three on two, three on three, whatever, and it was, you know... Yeah, like, big Ollie McBurney up front. Yeah. He's a, Look, let's get it right. Like, I know, like, he gets a lot of stick because he he looks like he's made out of like strings, <laughs> but and he's a good player and he works really hard. I mean, yeah. he does look very funny, like admittedly really funny. But, I mean... He'd be a great player to play. I mean, he'd be a pain in the ass to play against. He's just yeah. got, like arms and legs mm. and just like throwing himself everywhere. I just feel like they're just missing a striker. If they had Billy Sharp, maybe they could have got a goal. Yeah. Big fat Billy. Where is Billy now? Got sent off last game. Oh, uh, that's why. Yeah. Ah, shame. That's why. They don't but let you play again if you get sent off. They did, well, without him, they did all right. They, yeah. did, they did quite well. I thought, I mean, Li- Liverpool could have probably scored another two or three. Yeah, like, there was one know, Mane, Mane, the Mane ball in the box. I yeah, I know. <laughs> that, I, and then they I didn't did finish it. Like, what's going I on? I watched that. I watched the highlights and then I saw, obviously, Salah running through yeah. and I, when I he passed to Mane, mm. I gasped. Same. I think even Mane was just like, fuck. Yeah, yeah, what do I do? He was waiting. Oh, God, yeah. There's something going on with Salah, though. He's just not quite himself. I don't know if it's just because he got a little bit of stick from... 
um, what happened with Mane a couple of weeks ago. Yeah, and you can maybe. see that he's like trying so hard to get those goals. But the, yeah, no, but I, maybe he he's just possibly battling that inner instinct of just, I want to score all the time. But he's still doing yeah, that anyway. Do yeah, that. no, of course, of course. But it, it does seem to, yeah, at the moment they're not. He's just got a little bit of bit of confidence now, which is just like, it's hard, isn't it? When everyone looks at you and be like, all right, cool, can you score a start? <laughs> yeah, 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 exactly. Shit, what, exactly. No, they, I mean, there we go, Mane. I, I love Mane, though. He feels like he's like him. the nicest man in the, it's like him and Son. I just seem like the two nicest people in the whole Premier League. You and I like Kante. Like, uh, Oh fuck, and Kante. Yeah. What a five aside that would <laughs> be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> just the, the nice guys. Little stat here mm. from my my stat man. Stato. Stat man Jack, as they say. Nah, actually, stat man Dave's probably like trademarked that, <laughs> that stat yeah. man thing. So we'll just, we'll just say Jack. Uh, Liverpool haven't dropped any points against non-top six sides in twenty months. Twenty months. That's lo- that's, that's a, lot. a long time. That's, that's a, a long lot. time. Also, but also the concept of 20 months always confuses me. It's like what like well, yeah, new yeah, parents yeah. say. <laughs> it's like, oh, my kid is 31 months old. And you're just like... What? Also, tw- 20 months is also, you know, two months of those. You, you, there's no football, so... It still counts. No one beat us over the summer. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know what that yeah. says to me, though? I reckon they're going to win the league. Yeah, time. no, they, yeah, they, 100%. I, I we say it every out. week. I'm, I'm into it. I'm backing it. Yeah, I want yeah, them to. Yeah. Yeah. No, but it, as it, every time it's just like, nah, eventually, you know, there, there'll probably be a test. It's like they just keep on winning. It's not like there were any real sh- signs of weaknesses. Whereas, no. like, compared to, like, City, for example. One or two injuries, though. Like, you can see, like... Yeah, one yeah of course, of course. Ones. If you get, like, a bad then, one to Van Dijk and you lose Van Dijk and Alisson, if you lose, like, a Firmino okay. as yes. well, then yeah. you're, like, that's the season That's flipped. the worst-case scenario, though, isn't it? Yeah. Well, yeah, but, but if we're judging by happen. last season, how look how many yeah, points yeah, they, they finished on. If they carry, Look, Man City's dropped points already. Yeah. And, they and, 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 and they didn't really get many injuries last season, either, yeah. really. That's true. So they got quite, like, I don't know. If they can get lucky with injuries, I reckon it's all theirs. Looking at the table... Mm. Just seeing the five green W's and then everyone else has just, just got, got loads reds. of reds. Yeah, and yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, yeah. Oh, I think they might do it. Mm. Just sort it's of early days though, but I, I can I, I can sense it. Yeah, no, it might they're out in front. I, was, I think I said this last week. It'd be interesting to see how they like, properly lead from the properly front. Lead, yeah. like, mm. All the pressure's it's on stre- there. It's stressful, yeah, because you've got all those people chasing after you. Like, you, they will slip up at some point, but it's yeah. just how that works. Well, Liverpool, well done again. <laughs> um, <Boring>. Right, we'll, <laughs> we'll yeah, move on. Come yeah. on, yeah, mix it up. A You're bit. You're welcome. The group chats praise. Next game: Everton one, Man City three. Their title rivals, it seems. We've got Stephen McKinney, City fan. His reaction. Hey guys, it's Stephen here from Manchester. Just since City beat Everton 3 1, I can finally breathe and relax. It wasn't a great performance, but it was the performance of champions. I know our defence was really bad, nearly as bad as this shirt I'm wearing, I promise you. It was a gift, but that's what champions do. They win when they're playing badly. Thank God for Pickford's tiny little dinosaur arms. Nowhere near Mara's sumptuous free kick, but that's what we do. We do win this league despite all their injuries. It'll be the sweetest one yet, in my opinion, because Liverpool keep winning games and we keep needing to find a way to win. If we do, it'll be perfect. For a few things. One, the kit's not that bad. I don't I like, like it. it. Ain't. I don't it looks I, like I, a rocket ice lolly. I like the. You, you, also, you don't like it? Ice lollies I like rocket ice lollies. Oh, right. Okay, I okay. Do you okay. Like the kit, though? It just doesn't just look good on a grown man, does it? <laughs> well, you make, a, you make a good point. <laughs> <laughs> if you genuinely don't like something, don't wear it. Don't wear like, it. No, like, yeah. no one's still making know you're it. Still, like, you're a home shirt. It doesn't really matter. He had to go at Pickford for his little dinosaur arms. He, look, I feel like it's a, it's a tough one, isn't it? Because like it's a good hit, but it is on his sides, and I do think it like kind of bounces under. As if like, we're talking about the Mares, the Mares, the Mares free, the Mahrez free, free kick. kick. It was a great free yeah. kick, and I thought Mares that entire game was like yeah, he was, peak peak Mares. Yeah. He was just like really fluid, doing that one trick that he has yeah. again and again uh, and again. Yeah, 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 no, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. no, like that. It's, it's it like, works it's, every time. It's, it's like such a pain in the ass. It's like a slightly more languid version of Robin like Ro- Robin's yeah. the ratty like robot version <laughs> Rat- ratty wow, robot as in like he's like hunched and sort of just like I know what you mean he's a bit, a bit scrappy yeah, whereas, he's a bit whereas, scrappy with it he's just, like, just like, loose shoulders just yeah, like yeah, yeah. oh and I'm going he's this he's very way. liquid isn't he but like I thought that that was like absolute peak Mares but yeah. like he's free kick Struck really well. It is on Pickford's side. He's like positioned perfectly. It's not one of them ones where it's like yeah, a little seat, seat really late. Left, nothing like that. No, nothing like that. Yeah, it, just it, looks it like was... he just it, it nicks up off the ground, and it, wh- not going like oh I could save that, but it's just like it looked like he just mistimed his his dive. Chris first. Wilder will be fuming watching that at home. <laughs> 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 he, he, he watched that and he's like, my keeper better not do anything. Yeah, silly it does this like that him. again. I'm going to out going to Manchester. Yeah, yeah, no charge against City or United. Cancelling his rail card. Um, yeah, I mean Myers is like. As, as good a luxury player as you can yeah. have. Mm. Someone who's like, when everyone's fit, he won't play. 
But then when he does play, it's like, oh, you've actually got a really good player to just come so, on. So, so good. He's 30 next year, though. Like, he's like, he's, Is he? Yeah, there's not a lot of place for him to go. That's why I think it's like... It well, he's won a title now. Two titles now. Yeah. yeah. But, but when, it, when they signed him, yeah. it felt like they just signed him so no one else could have him. Well, we yeah, they, didn't need, they didn't need him. They no, they like, didn't. Oh, you know what? They really need, they really need Mahrez. They really mm. need another winger. Not at all. <laughs> yeah. It was a bit dramatic, though, with that Sterling goal line technology. It was. Game. I enjoyed that. <laughs> I enjoyed that. That was great. Just seeing the... Oh, and then he mucked up the rebound. I know. And oh, yeah. then looked, he's like, okay, now that I've mucked it up, I'm going to look to the ref and be like, do, is that the first yeah, one? Please. It was going. <laughs> yes. Okay, good. I'm out of jail. So the first goal, that was the, oh, De Bruyne. That was yeah, the De Bruyne. Oh, guy, mate. Yeah. Guy. Also, a lot to be said for Gabriel Jesus doing like a oh, he had front a little, flip oh, yeah, while yeah, he yeah. headed it as well. It was so good. I just, it headed quite, it with the back of his head was while he was facing A little bit vampire he, he was just. He was very just, obviously... Head first, shock header. Yeah. But I was in like, <laughs> like he was he went f- fully for it, and the keeper was like coming out. Yeah, it was quite. Bright. I would have. Like, it was oh, on, a, you know it was on an absolute it's, plate, though, wasn't it? Yeah, of course. I think it was like because it was yeah. It was uh, Victor and Ichibi after the game. They were like, "Would you have scored that?" And he was like, "Yes." Yeah. Even <laughs> even I would have scored. <laughs> <it>. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I think even I'd have done that. Yeah. 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 It was harder not to uh, that phrase, but it was harder not to. It was like. He's so good at just those whips. I thought oh, there was I could a score a couple of goals off of his. There was there was a poll on Twitter. Is he the best crosser of all ever in the Premier League? And it was like either him or Beckham. Everyone's forgotten about David Beckham because right people only remember police sunglasses and bad haircuts. But like <laughs> and, and, good hair, <laughs> and good haircuts. And good haircuts. Kind of good haircuts. Well. A lot of bad ones. Yeah, you, know, you need. We've to, had. I've had. You most need to of wade them. through the I've shit to find them. where you. Um, but yeah, I mean, Kevin De Bruyne is just one of those players where I think he's like underrated for how quickly he yeah. brings the ball forward through midfield as yeah. well. Like when he starts sprinting, he's like I think, full power. Like I think he's between like quite scary running between him and Van Dijk, they are like both by far like the the best players in the league. And McGinn in the world. And McGinn, my new favorite oh my player. We'll get I, we'll get, I, 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 I love, love I love Tom McGinn. Oh I love McGinn. Um, and then yeah, the the last goal, obviously the VR was a lot of fun. That was great. Yeah. yeah. But I mean, Everton had this had the chances. They uh, played much better this week. Calvert Calvert Lewin just I nicking goals. That's so jokes, much so better from that. Everton this season already. Yeah, because but they're, they're, I think they're one of those teams where they sort of like they just blow so hot and cold, and I think that they're kind of like Richarlison kind of hasn't really had the impact yeah. that they thought he was gonna, yeah. and Calvert Lewin's kind of been struggling for goals, which is why I don't blame him for like. Doing a Nugent really and actually just like as well. um, he, was he was genuinely there, like, pissed off. He, he was, was just like, there. "What are you doing?" <laughs> yeah, because you got to think about it. That's a goal bonus. You just basically just like nicked like five grand out. <gasps> yeah, yeah, yeah. He, wouldn't have a goal. Oh, he wouldn't have a goal bonus. Would you have enough, and yeah, yeah, but yeah, yeah. you just can't steal goals like that because obviously he must have something because his reaction was you like. You think Calvert Lewin gives a? F- I know, but you just can't do that. Calvert Lewin's like, "Oh no, I'm a nice guy. No, I'm a striker. I've done that all day long. This is the easiest goal I'm ever gonna score in my life. It was going in anyway." How are you claiming that You're goal? You're a goal scorer and he scored a goal. Did oh. you see the goal Sanchez claimed in Italy? No, I didn't. It was shot on target. It deflected off his back. Goes in and he just turns and well, just runs to the corner. Wow. Well, goal's Ridic- a goal. Okay, so same thing as last week. Tight at the top. Liverpool seem a little bit more assured, but... I'm quite excited to see what City actually do, though. Whether they when actually they really kick other? on. Oh, I don't know, actually. Because the game last season when they played each other, when it was like... Bernardo Silva run more miles than anyone has ever run before in the Speaking entire of world. Speaking of did he uh, miss that penalty? He skied it, didn't he? Against Liverpool. Let's not be mean to Mares. I know I love Mares, but I just have to mention that. He's uh, another <laughs> one for the nice guy fives. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't, I don't love him that much, but... I like him. He's, I do. I love him as a player. He's great. Well, we've got the title challengers down. Mm-hmm. Now we're going to have the little European hopefuls. Uh, the kind of the three teams who we, I guess seem like the most assured of getting the top five places. So mm-hmm. we've got obviously Spurs, Chelsea and Leicester. Oh. My, my, ev- Everyone I love Leicester. so much. Yeah, yeah. West Ham. yeah not going to happen. <laughs> you're right, but you're just nowhere near Europe. Oh, I'll take 16th. Yeah. <laughs> I'll take it now. You, I said, you, said, last, you said last week you were like, oh, mid-table. That was last week. Okay, yeah, true. Mm-hmm. Uh, okay, so we've got Spurs 2-1 Southampton. Uh, George reacting, so we'll listen to that first. Okay, George Achille here talking about the Spurs Southampton game at the stadium, which you can see right behind me. I'm at the top, what a view! But yes, we finally got a win oh, after a bad couple of weeks of results. We finally get that win, it feels good to get three points, even if we had to grind for it. I mean, Aurea getting sent off was stupid. I don't know why he did that, um, knowing he was already in the yellow. Most of us didn't even see the first one, but very frustrated going on to 10 men, had to hold on squeeze, but got the three points. That's all that really matters at the end of the day. So, come on, you Spurs. How embarrassing. What? Oreo getting red card? The whole thing. Like, you went from being finalist in Champions League, fi- like, tri- Champions League finalist. Yeah. And then you come back and you're super happy about getting a win. 
Uh, you know what? Well, we know what would they, be. They, they earned oh, that win as well. That's one of the best I've seen Harry Kane play in a long, long time yeah. as well. He was he one of those looked like a bit fitter. He looked a lot fitter. Looked like he was one of those where it's just like we're not going to leave without three points. To be fair, Southampton are a, de- a decent unit this year as well. They look a mm. bit more of a more so, yeah, yeah, a yeah. team. Rather so than just it's, getting swept. it's not that easy, especially like they're 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 not the most informed team at the moment Spurs so mm-hmm. like yeah. getting a win you know you just you will take it as George Cla- said yeah classic Aurier <laughs> as well though that as well yeah just, he's just, just so dumb. quickly he's as well like <laughs> you're just you're just you're just like mate what are you doing and everyone was, around him just like what are you doing it, it was really so, yeah. it was really soft they were soft but it was they were silly they were just silly but then because the they off. were waiting because it was they thought it was off the pitch so everyone was like I was a foul in there. Yeah. Mm. Every Sunday league player knows, play to the whistle. <laughs> we should get him in Hatney and Leighton Premier. That's, that's it. Just yeah. just really teach Serge, Serge Aurier. Yeah, 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 exactly. Is that, it can't be, can it? Spurs obviously won. Chelsea won. And Leicester also won. Mm. Chelsea 2-0. Any thoughts on that? Not loads. Like, Tammy didn't score again, but I thought he looked, like, lively. And just yeah, like, I don't know if his, his sort of luck of purple patches already no. I feel like I feel like the chances just aren't really like falling to him a little bit but like also I think he's just sort of like having to I mean they came in bunches didn't they those goals so I think that the, the numbers sort of flattered to see for a little bit mm. but like he was he was doing everything you want from a from a centre forward I just felt like they were just sort of like they were just lacking a, yeah. a little bit but still, still, grind, still first, grind it out the first good game in a while for Jorginho I felt mm. Mm. like he actually his penalty actually played. worked yeah <laughs> and everything that he does I don't know well, I don't know the Whack thought behind that their is weird mental techniques, it? but um, I, was ch- I was chatting to a Chelsea fan yesterday and he said that um, he, he doesn't like Willian what I was about he, to say, he, he had a good game. Yeah, no, yeah. no, no, no. He said, like, oh, he's not scoring fir- in a while. But he said, he said, oh, it's the first time he's played well in ages. Yeah, yeah. And obviously, I don't watch Chelsea religiously, but I always think he's one of their more dangerous players. Yeah, I mean, in that season when they were like on their ass and they were like mid-table, he yeah. was their he was only, a, he was yeah, their yeah, only exactly, player exactly, keeping them yeah. together. And he scored and a lot was, of goals that season. He was a bit leaving as well. Mm. And I remember I was like, if they may let him leave, they. No, I mean, he doesn't score. He looks like he's fighting for his position the way he's playing yesterday. He doesn't look like he's ready to leave. Pedro. Pulisic just Mason is well. mm. where Pulisic, is, I don't, where is Pulisic? I don't know. I don't know. He must not be. Is he all right? Much. Has anyone checked on him? Has anyone checked I'll, on I'll Pulisic? He's, he's missing that. He's missing that. <laughs> he's still texting. young. He got his, he got his number. <laughs> no, I don't. He don't. No, plus three numbers. Weird. You know what I mean? Americans. <laughs> yeah, no, don't um, did Brian have any chances? I can't remember. <laughs> Probably. No, I don't even. Don't, I mean, it, it was just stupid. Did Dunk do a big header or something? <laughs> <laughs> probably, Mine probably done. a few. Yeah. yeah. Um, oh, Gaytan Bong put in a good cross. I remember that once. Nice. Yeah. Which is a fun name. Cross from Bong. Mm-hmm. Cross from good, Bong. Yeah, that's great. Uh, and then Leicester five nil. This is my favourite. Yeah. I, I, if Arsenal don't get European football, Give and Leicester, Leicester do, I, I'm actually. Oh, you know what? I really like Leicester. So, so do I. I I'm think most. I, I think most Arsenal fans do. You know. Why, I, I why celebrated Arsenal with. Fans? I don't know. I don't know. I do, innit? I like, celebrated when well, like, I won the league. Kindred, like, why, why, why this? Why is I this relationship? Know. I think we're like... jealous of their football. Yeah, I was. I literally posted about them when they won the league. I celebrated like I was a Leicester fan. I went to get on a train oh, and I get down no, there. I don't know about that, though. No, I was really happy for him. And I would never be happy for anyone else to win the I'm league. I'm genuinely happy for Brendan Rodgers, who, oh, after, yeah. who after left Liverpool and then the Celtic thing kind of ended in, on quite a sour yeah. note. Like now he's like really kicking on, and like they've got, I think they've got Liverpool next week. Mm. So, oh yeah, they do, they do, they yeah, do, they do. Which would be Liverpool, one. Yeah, Liverpool, be Liverpool away as mm. well, which is mate, that'd be that'd be a great one. Tough. It'd be interesting to see his reception because I feel like there's going to be a lot of like people sort of what is even the word, just sort of like rewriting the history that he had there because he didn't really in, win in anything. In a positive or negative way. In a negative way. I like oh yeah, because yeah. like he, he, they they played such good football there, and he, yeah. like they had like a couple of really good they seasons. They, where they he made really all close. their fans like believe. Yeah. 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 You know now I mean? they'll probably yeah. They're but it's the belief that gets you, isn't it? It's yeah, the hope that gets you. Yeah, it's true. It's true. Chelemans as well was great. The whole Chilemans game. Chelemans is great. Oh, I love him. Also, I like having a Barnes, Harvey Barnes. That's actually like nice. A good He's Barnes. I'm not an Ashley Barnes. Yeah, as in someone who's like not a shit out. I like Ashley Barnes. Yeah, no, no. You like Ashley Barnes because he's a shit out. He's horrible, yeah. I like Harvey Barnes because he's, he's a he's nice, nice Barnes. <laughs> he's <laughs> nice like guy. a nice guy. Finally, a nice Barnes. <laughs> yeah. I've really wanted to like a Barnes for so long. <laughs> um, I'm coming round to Brendan as well, just because of a, like big Brenda impressions of him when he was at Liverpool. Didn't like it because they were playing well. Yeah, but now like uh, the, his interview after on match today, his interview after the game, he's like, oh, he's actually quite a nice guy. Like I think he's, he's very David Brent, isn't he? I think but. he has been possibly brought down a few pegs as well since his time at Liverpool mm. and it shows in the way he talks about his team and he's like we're trying to do the right thing we're a good counter-attacking side but now you know we want to emulate the best sides in that they can counter-attack and when you 
have possession for seventy percent of the game, you can do something with it. You can't remember how good he was when he was at Swansea. Yeah, well. I, I, yeah, that I team, remember that. Team, that, was, that yeah. team was unbelievable, yeah. and I feel like he just does, but he does well with not a lot. The I feel like two days and Joe Allen. Oh mate, what well, they had bloody Leon Britton being the best passer in Europe as well. Which was just <laughs> Everyone sh- said the the, what, the Welsh Javi was it. He was uh, the Welsh Iniesta. Oh, yeah. Alan, no, yeah. Alan Iniesta is <laughs> what the, they tried to make happen. So, Brent, is never going to happen. Little word on Newcastle. Not going that well Sad, for Brucey. Yeah. I like Bruce, but. Do you? Is, yeah. I don't, right. Do you not? No, yeah, no, it's fair. I mean, he's. Yeah, he's I like how much he loves his son. Yeah, where is he? Where is he Alex up? Bruce. No, I'd, I'd, I'd be very surprised if he's not at Newcastle. No, he's definitely. <laughs> he's, like, he's, like, he's like club vice captain. There was a stat where he'd like played only like five minutes for any manager in the Premier League that wasn't his dad. Oh my god! Really? Which, which I might have made up, but feels like it's true. Which means it's true. I'm willing to go along with that. Don't Google I don't, me. I don't, never I Google, never I Google me. Steve Bruce is watching it. Well, if he does watch it, I don't know. But he, watches this, he's <laughs> yeah, like, he loves this. How's someone clocked on? <laughs> Someone's finally clocked on. Um, yeah, not looking great for Newcastle because they're down there with, you know, Watford and yeah. But ain't going well. Villa, but Villa, um, but Villa are also down there, and they're doing all right. We have a few down there. So, uh, Wolves, Watford. That was a nice little mm. six pointer, I guess. Uh, two nil Wolves. Uh, we've also got obviously uh, Villa, two two Burnley. Um, Tom McGinn, McGinn. Ain't it John McGinn? Amazing. John McGinn. Yeah. It is. Easy. It is John McGinn. Don't keep saying Tom. <laughs> you, I saw you say something like Brandon. Brian earlier. Brandon. Brandon. <laughs> I said Brian McGinn. Brian McGinn, I think, is a, is an actor. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, I maybe won't, you did I then. won't yeah. forget John McGinn's it's name when I heard it. It's just generic names, isn't it? It's but, great. Um, Tom, he's uh, great. He's just one of them players where he's just like, yes. Watching okay. him, I'm just like, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Just really, enjoying it. Really good player. He's playing as well as pretty much anyone in the league right now. Yeah, all. Left, I mean, not, 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 Let's not go there. Not I mean, like, he, like when, you're in, right, when you're in that team, it's like, how good is De Bruyne going to do if he okay. can't, like, cross to anyone? He's yeah, doing everything. Okay, yeah, no, that, that is true. That is true. And he technically, I guess, scored two goals. I love the celebration mean? when he actually scored. So and he's just like, oh, yeah, yeah, go yeah. straight to the <laughs> like, I love that. halfway line. Chris Wood, I, I am now seriously contemplating taking Barnes out and putting I like Big Chris. In. I watched him rip apart West Ham a couple of seasons ago. He's a good player. Yeah. I mean, big meathead. No, no, yeah, but big like, meathead, but he's like, it's good in the air. Knows how to use his meathead. <laughs> yeah. But um, no, Villa, Villa uh, they've sort of, weirdly, I feel like their position in the league, I think they're 18th. Mm. Mm. It doesn't really no. fit like how, I think they've actually played quite well. They've just got maybe a little bit unlucky table, and though. a little bit of inexperience. They've thrown away really a couple. Been, yeah. But I feel like they've two. deserved maybe three a little two. bit better. <laughs> like three now, For example, yeah. against Arsenal, yeah. they deserve better. They they deserve to at least draw that game. Like they they should have really they, won. I think they did it at Spurs as well. They were they were up and then they lost it, and then they yeah. obviously like gave away the goal against. That, I feel like yeah, they, it's just obviously they're probably maybe a little bit they get a bit nervy and whatever, but they probably deserve to be a few more points better off. I feel than like they they're alright. They got some they got some good players. Um, was it yeah, El Ghazi's goal as well? Yeah. It was like a front post volley. That was a fucking. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, oh yeah, that was, was a, a lov- lovely little volley that whipped in outside nice. of the foot. Just oh, it's Love lovely. That. Yeah, no, they great. Um, like a young Sam Diss that one. But, <laughs> yeah, really. What, steaming in front post <laughs> from centre back. I've steamed. Okay. On a Saturday back night. You're steaming. <laughs> yeah. Hey, come on, look. We've, all, we've all steamed. Uh, but uh, so John McGinn, we all love. Um, not me. Wolves, what? <laughs> do you not? I just since I heard his name at the Emirates, I can't love him again. So, oh, yeah, oh but, you yeah, know, he's a decent yeah, player. Yeah, you know, he's a good player. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so uh, Wolves two 0 Watford. Uh, I was actually quite happy to see Wolves because I feel like I don't want to see them lose. I quite like their team. Mm-hmm. Nah, they'll be fine. Watford. I mean, if you're going to win against anyone, You've Watford win is against the them. best team to play. They gave up a lot of possession against them though. They gave, so, they gave up a goal so, as well. So did oh, they. Yeah. Yeah. Arsenal did that mm, as well. Yeah. We drew against right. I. The more Watford play, <laughs> the more it makes like. The, more, the, the clearer it is that that was one of the worst performances I've ever seen us play. Yeah. Like, it's embarrassing. It was very funny. Oh, yeah, I forgot. It was very funny to watch. <laughs> so we've just turned the fan off. So the audio for that little bit was probably a little bit whirly. But now it's, it's fine. all right. At least it was now the unimportant fine. team. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah exactly. Yeah. <laughs> Bournemouth 2, West Ham 2. Yeah. Your impressions? Uh, we've done all right again. Yarmolenko was really good again. I love him. He's, he's really great. Good. Yeah. Also, I found out that his nickname at West Ham is Squarehead. What? Who told you Who's that? Yeah, where'd you get that information from? Just no things, don't I? <laughs> <laughs> no, I saw it. You I, just made that up. Oh, I love him so much. I need to have a nickname. No, for that he's. Him. Um, oh, he, he, I saw it on the Athletic, um, and they just like he's referred to as Squarehead, and he does have a square head. I mean, uh, Squarehead, good left foot, but yeah, like okay, call yeah. him good left foot is like not a good nickname. No, it's is it? not. Yeah. Um, that's that's also that's. 
Kolarov's title. <laughs> is it? Yeah. No, I it's mean, not. It's been, just been I, a while I, ago. Yeah, and it's, yeah, of course. Um, but yeah, I thought I thought we played all right. It's just what a, it, like we, we like whenever we play against Bournemouth, there's always loads of goals. Callum Wilson scores against us every time. That's mm-hmm. like always like my big fantasy tip. It's just like if they're playing against us, just Wilson like just to score against, just yeah. whack him straight in. King played well as well. Yeah. Cresswell got another goal. I was I was batting happy with that because like he'd been out for a while. Masawaka had been in front of him, probably yeah. deservedly so. But after like last week and this week, I'm. I'm pretty happy. happy I, I feel yeah, like yeah. we're going to be fine. Yeah, yeah I feel like right, Pellegrini right. was happy. Like Fornals is starting to come into it a bit more. It felt a bit like both teams sort of threw it away, though, in a yeah. weird way. Because I think it kind of just like if it kind of fizzled out. If it felt like it was a bit like we were both going to like gun for it, and then at the end we were just kind of like should we just nip it there. Yeah, and we were both like, yeah, take that point. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah that's fine. It's fine. That, we, moved, we moved up to third very briefly up until Leicester like absolutely shellacked. I don't Newcastle. think it really counts when you've still got quite a few yeah. games to play. No, it does but count. It okay, counts. it does right, count. Right. Yeah, we're, I mean, yeah, we're Arsenal. We're above you, aren't we? Yeah, no, that's true. So, and also, we're probably winning? not going <laughs> to get any points. Um, no. But the, oh, you know, what I really liked w- for uh, Josh King's goal that was yeah. not given mm. and then given because that's the opposite of like most of the most of the VAR decisions this season oh, have yeah, been like yeah, yeah. oh they've scored and then VAR oh it's ruled out yeah. this one was ruled out straight away but the VAR overturned it and then you got it was like a little bit of delayed gratification it was almost yeah. like you, you scored you thought you had a goal it got taken away from you like oh okay we've accepted the fact that it's not a goal now and then VAR gives you a goal it's sort of like a free goal yeah it's like Oh yeah, yeah we're one nil up. Great, the goal, it's right? great. Oh, I really enjoyed it. It's nice. It was really I didn't, tight, I didn't, though. I didn't enjoy that. I wish, well, it, I wish, <laughs> I wish they <laughs> would cut it out. Obviously. Sorry, I told that to the wrong. Oh, person, I loved it. Yeah. It was well no, good. It was, I was, I was, oh yeah, that's, that's no. I mean, it's nice to see the goals get given in it, and like, if, if anyone's going to score it, I mean, King Wilson, that whole team's just full of likable yeah, players, exactly, isn't it? Yeah, but uh, no, and I mean, for the rest of the season, what do you think this is going to be? Sort of run of the mill, just this is our, this is our year. We're getting Champions League football. You've done all right. No, we're not. I'm, I'm, I'll be bang up in the table. Top, top off. Take that. No, 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 no. Mid- Say about tenth, eleventh. Nah. Come on, we come tenth, we come eleventh last season. Did you? I think so, yeah. That's genuinely Don't surprising. Google me again. Never Google me. <laughs> no, no, <laughs> that's just stay stuff. I'm actually quite. Oh, fair. no, we were like we were we were only like we were just behind Wolves, and Wolves had this fantastic season. We just had a so-so one. Yeah, so. that's true. The last one, Palace two, Norwich nil. Mm. Norris, uh, Norris, 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 uh, Norwich, shocking. Yeah, they were shit. Um, <laughs> but Palace actually like. Good and they actually finished this week. Well, yeah. say finished Milivojevic. It was whatever. a bad. It was a bad game and they scored their one millionth penalty. Yeah. But you know what? I'm happy for him. Yeah, Milivo- in a way. You know what's still annoying? Stace. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 exactly. <laughs> um, and then Wilfred just, I love. It. I think everyone's accepted the fact that it's like, ah, oh, he he did want to leave, but he's playing again, and we 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 all still. I think love he him. still. I think he still looks like he wants to leave, but he's just yeah. like whenever he plays, no, I'm just like. It's he's just like, like him just like dancing in a shop window like he's in Amsterdam. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Is that too bleak? Can I not say that? Nah, that's fine. That's fine. Also, shout out to Andrew Townsend. Since he changed his hair, new oh, man, mate. new man, new player, new confidence. The confidence is yeah. oozing out. That, of him. that rug as well. He's not even gone like David Silver. He's just like, I'm gonna keep it normal height. He's like, I'm gonna keep growing it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna <laughs> keep on growing it. It's just, gonna, it's just like, it's like full on kid and play now. It's, it's like, like a project. Top. It's like, it's just no. I'm gonna, I'm gonna fully do this as much as possible. It's like when you're growing watercress at bored, primary school. And he wants to just, yeah. He's, he's got hair like watercress. Yeah. It's just like you know what I'm gonna keep just doing keep this. Going. Yeah. How big can I get it? Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Um, so yeah, good, good little result for Palace. They're doing all right. I think they'll be. They'll be fine this season. Fingers yeah. crossed. I like Roy. So Pippa, yes. you're obviously an Arsenal fan. Me and you, we've been we've been through a lot over been the last it. few seasons. <laughs> um, but what are your thoughts on Arsenal at the moment, as you know, as a club where we are? Because there's been a lot of chat. Where should I start, Emery? Yeah, go on. Emery's uh, a good start. Emery's a good. It's start. a we- it's a weird one because obviously when he first joined Arsenal, I was one of the fans. You know, I'm always positive I was mm. like give him a few seasons but yeah, I realised it's like it's been two seasons already and there's been literally no improvement I mean we've had the, the extra signings that we didn't think we were going to get mm. but his style of play whatever that is is not benefiting us at all because he's so negative do you, do you, do you feel like there genuinely has been no improvement because I feel like Almost I feel like there have there have definitely been improvements for example in, in the big games that we play like especially over the last you know five years We've never, we've always struggled in the big games to mm. impose our game and, and and show some sort of like resolve, especially if if we go one 0 down or or if we go two one up and, and trying to hold a lead sort of thing. I think we have made improvements there, but I get what you're saying. Uh, yeah, yeah. in terms of like the style of play, maybe it hasn't quite. Do you we have haven't one? quite. <laughs> not that I know of. Well, no, we, th- we have a negative. Yeah, style at there. the moment. Uh, not really, not as identifiable as, for example, when Wenger was there, he had a, he had time to implement his game, or whatever. Naturally, I think the way Emery plays 
is kind of sort of a, a counter attacking wait to see what you do for us to then mm. that works against the big teams which is why I think we've done better against the big teams mm. but I feel like maybe it's against the smaller teams they just let you have the ball you can't counter attack when you've got the ball so it just yeah, like just like I feel like maybe that posts. is maybe that is it. I don't know what you think. If that, I feel like the players do their own thing when it gets to like the seventieth minute because that game against Tottenham, he started off defensively. Like he put in a, yeah. a defensive midfield because he has literally no faith in his defenders. That's mm. why I feel anyway. Mm -hmm. And then seventieth minute, I feel like that's when the game started kicking off and we got the goal back. That's because the midfielders started doing their own thing and obviously we had the subs. Like Ceballos came on, yeah. he was more creative. Yeah. But even against Aston Villa, when Doozy started doing his own thing, that's not how he started playing the game. And yeah. I feel like he took his own initiative to say, do you know what, let's just go for it. So, overall impressions, Emery? I'm not going to do the whole in or out thing. No, 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 no. I don't want to ask me that. No, no, no. <laughs> but as in, you still want to obviously give it a bit more time. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I said three seasons. I know it sounds like a lifetime, especially Yeah, in the but you want to so give someone, paced, you know, a, a fair whack at it, yeah, I guess. Yeah, and he hasn't had a fair chance yet. Quick, quick word on Shaka, captain. <sighs> questionable. Very questionable. The but only then, thing I'll but say, who else is there to choose? The only thing I'll say is a lot of the players see Shaka as yeah I know that the they all see so. him they all have big respect for him that's why I feel a lot of fans don't know that but if you see our team the team respects him obviously Ian has made a decision that works for the team Arsenal Man United tonight mm. I, should, I should have say Man United Arsenal mm. the mean nothing derby what as they call it right well you have to explain that because it means no, it means nothing. It means everything. It doesn't mean anything anymore. No, it used to mean loads I, I, of stuff. I, 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 I it do doesn't mean it. It doesn't that. mean anything. I say, this is just like the biggest like up. sentiment that like means nothing anymore. It's, it's still yeah. It's two. It's two clubs and two sets of fans who still who just wish it was like, oh, it matters to us. Yes. Yeah, it, yeah. it still matters to me. Yeah. No, of course it, it matters to us loads because yeah. it's still. But for the rest of it, it's like oh, because I really want to solidify fifth. Yeah, I mean, it's <laughs> like don't take it's, the mic. It's just, but it's true. <laughs> no, it's the current state of the two clubs, like yeah. at the moment, I say the state of the two clubs is maybe a bit harsh. The state of Man United is different to the state of Arsenal, mm. I think. But just in terms that. of in terms of yeah, in terms of where we want to be and where we're looking to finish this season, it's probably similar. Man United. It is Arsenal. traditionally one of like I remember growing up, it was like the big game that everyone looked forward to all season yeah. long. And it would dominate. It would dominate amazing. the entire yeah. narrative a, of a season. Yeah, hundred yeah. percent. It just has. Well, it has yeah. none of that sort of cultural impact yeah. anymore, now, or now even importance now at it's all. City Liverpool, like yeah. that's yeah. that is literally taking that that spot. Um, even North London it's derby. North London rights, derby is like way more important than that for me. But it's still like, for bragging rights. Do you know what I mean? Like, because if we lo if Arsenal oh, cool, lose yeah, against Man United, United, yeah, but like you got bragging rights when West Ham beat Man United. It just felt like just another win. But no, but that that was actually true though. Yeah, it was in the in the stands. Everyone just like, oh, cool, that was quite a comfortable win, rather than it being like this. Is Man United? It's not really. It, Man it was United impressively no like banal. Yeah, it was just, it was like, just cool. like yeah. Oh, cheers okay. for that. Yeah, a nice little win that. Pick them um, up. Stacey just told us that now Sky Sports are billing this as so. What used to be the gigantic title deciding game is it used to mean what was it? You, titles. It used to decide title. I mean, it literally did. So me calling it the no, like the mean nothing derby. I'm is, just basically it, correct then. Yeah, you sort <laughs> of give me a job, Sky. Sky Sports said so. Are you sure you don't work for Sky? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Just take off yeah. the shirt. Sky uh, it's w oh, sorry. It's weirdly accurate. Um, okay, so we've actually got Adam who's going to preview this game, Man nice. United Arsenal. So it's a massive game between United and Arsenal. Both teams need three points. And I know Arsenal fans are getting giddy like they usually do ahead of the game, thinking we're just going to be a walkover. The facts are United have been inconsistent. And in those games against Leicester and Chelsea against the bigger opposition. We have turned up and put in a performance. Arsenal's defence is very, very dodgy. I know you were all excited about David Luiz, but if we can get at him, we can get goals and hopefully get a result. It's going to be an interesting one though. I mean, yeah, that, that's, he's pointed to our obvious weakness there. Yeah, which, which is, and it is one though. And if you, yeah. honestly, I swear to God, if you lot do them silly, like, silly little goal kicks again, the ones you just give away yeah, a goal from be, yeah. every yeah, yeah, single yeah. week and never learn your lesson, that's then Leno. He loves to play out from the back. And I don't no, but why no, but but but, like, but that that's not just a Leno has decided we need to play from the back, so we're all going to play for that. That's obviously not Leno's. No. That doesn't come from Leno. That comes from obviously Unai and you know, yeah, management but when team. When was it, like he hardly ever takes like a goal kick? No, it's true. No, no, because got, because of that's how he we've been instructed to play. It's not like from mm. Leno's like I'm going to play out from the back. I don't know what you lot are going to do, but this <laughs> is what I'm going to do. So you better if get on board already, with if, it. You've already got like quite a nervous. Back, back four, don't give them the ball because yeah. like they look like you're just rolling a grenade to them. They're just yeah. like, oh, to but but it's 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 from a thing of like not knowing. We all know going into every game.
we'd like to play from the back mm. or and we're going to try and play from the back but it's like they don't it's like we sort of don't have a plan of when Socrates or David Luiz gets it yeah what do we do what now? do we do or like where should everyone be kind of as a standard structure of every time we get it. like mm. you should be there the winger should go wide or whatever it is it's like we don't every time is just different because we're like oh he's got it oh god why didn't we plan and for this so nervy on the yeah. ball like, what do I do that's that? why I quite rate it when David Luiz gets it and he just wallops it yeah he just goes how far can I kick this or <laughs> everyone just goes nah just get, everyone get out <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> just, 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 let's just give up um, but uh, yeah that is true from Adam I think he missed out on the fact that United's defence is also not yeah, in great shape. Great. Didn't really want to talk about Thanks, his own team Adam. There. Uh, but, uh, and he's got a team full of youngsters as well. Is Rashford, is Rashford still out? Or so I think Rashford is still out. I think and Pogba it was now his. As well. Yeah, Pogba's yeah, out for a bit. That, yeah. But Mason Greenwood's in, in the goals. Arsenal should. Oh, I don't know. Nah, I don't even want. I don't even want to say it. because we can't. We never ever 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 win at Old Trafford. So yeah. we we should really win. We won't. Today Probably will be the day that we actually win against. No, win no, 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 yeah, no, 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 no. Don't say that. Don't say that. Don't say that. I reckon you're going to draw nil nil. Yeah. Oh, I, reckon I, mean, I reckon it's going to be so dull. I reckon it's going to be so dull really? that I just on switch off and play FIFA well. instead. Perfect. Right. Well, we're going to go on to I love to see it or we love to see it. If there has been anything that you have loved. Um, no, I always get this wrong that you loved to see. Go on, Pippa. What's your. It's a bit of a cheeky one. I don't know. Well, I love to see it personally. I loved uh, Danny Ings' little pounce on Hugo Lloris. Oh, yeah, no, that was nice. That was funny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot all about that. This yeah. Morning. Hugo Lloris is a weird one, isn't it? <laughs> he, is, he is odd, yeah. What's happening there? Well, he's like, and then comes up with like some unbelievable beard, saves after that. It's, mm. it's, yeah, odd. Yeah. Uh, Sam? I like to see nothing. No, I don't, I don't know. Like, um, I get, like it's, it sounds it like... It is Monday morning, Sam. It is Sam. Monday morning. Hey, I'll, I'll, I'll forgive you. Yeah, I like to see your face. No, I... Um, <laughs> No, I just I just like to see Yarmolenko just doing well oh, yeah, again because oh, he was nice. just quite nice because like an Achilles injury is like such like a bleak yeah one. horrible 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 yeah. and to be a winger so that's a, that could very easily just be like you're you're done yeah. now mm-hmm. and to come back in and like everyone be like Ryan Fredericks comes straight out and he was just like we play completely differently when he's here we all look for him with the yeah, ball and I'm just 100%. like I'm like properly happy for him yeah. and he's got big goals now yeah I'm happy nice. I like that um, love to see it I love to see it was the Oh, McGinn. I love seeing McGinn doing well. No, no. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll give it to the. I'll give it to um, Josh King's goal that was ruled out, but then given. So then yeah, everyone's like, yeah. yes. To be fair, I do, I lo- I do like, I like in that. general. Even though it was against West Ham, I do love to see that positive yeah. outcome from it. Yeah, it's great because then everyone. Just hopefully like, oh. that happens against. Because then us. suddenly you got loads of, loads of people van- fans of VR. It's like, oh, we like VR again. Yeah. It's like, oh, it's nice. That is it for the group chat this week. Sandis, thank you very much for joining. Hope you enjoyed it. I loved it, mate. Yeah. Obviously. As two twos go. And <laughs> Pippa, thank you very much for joining again. Thank you. Um, and, yeah, fingers crossed we get the win tonight. We'll see. Uh, but also, guys, thank you very much for tuning in. Uh, don't forget, you can leave your reactions. So tweet us at Copper90, your reactions from the weekend's games, and we might use it in next week's episode. Hope you enjoyed. We'll see you then. <laughs>